know what's going we on. We are looking still at some rain, yeah. some rain across our area. Mm -hmm. Tomorrow actually expected to be pretty nice, just some light scattered showers, but then another storm does arrive by Christmas Day. So there's a look outside. Yeah, the rain not so bad, but that traffic getting to the airport. Uh, it is busy out there, people traveling, and unfortunately that trip back on Christmas on Thursday, we are also expecting some rain. So there is a look at that radar. Still pretty active. However, a lot of places in LA and Ventura are looking clear at this moment. So it is mostly to our east in the Inland Empire, places like Riverside and to Beaumont and Yucaipa still receiving some rain. And here are the latest rainfall totals for the Inland Empire in Orange County. These are as of early this evening, Laguna Niguel with nearly two inches of rain today. Garden Grove about an inch and a half and then just about a third of an inch uh, to three quarters of an inch in places like Idlewild, Corona and Ontario. But again, the rain is still falling, so those numbers will increase. As we head towards to tonight, uh, this is 1130 in the evening. You can see that just some light scattered showers. Those showers will continue to diminish in those overnight hours. And by tomorrow morning for your commute, if you are heading into work, we're looking at mostly dry conditions. Still some light scattered showers throughout the day as we are still looking at an unsettled weather pattern. But most of your Tuesday should be pretty good for Christmas Eve. Then by Wednesday afternoon, the rain returns, the next storm system, and we are going to be impacted especially heavily as we head towards the evening hours. So here's what we're looking at. Some scattered showers on Tuesday, and then storm number two arrives on Wednesday into Thursday with a chance of some lingering showers into your Friday. This will be a colder storm, so we are looking at the possibility of some showers and some snow in those lower elevations. So places like the grapevine could be impacted. Here's some temperatures for tomorrow, topping out mostly in those 50s and in the 60s. I'll send it back to you. All good, thank you.